hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to install the latest version of kali linux on raspberry pi now this works either you're using the raspberry pi 3 3b 4 or 5. first we need our raspberry pi in this case i'm using the raspberry pi 3b with one gigabyte ram second we need a micro sd card which we're going to use for the installation and also as a storage device third we need a card reader which we're going to use to create a bootable os for raspberry pi you would also need a mouse, a keyboard, and for power, you could use a power bank or a 15 watt charger which you can plug directly to your Raspberry Pi. You could even power it directly from your PC USB. I'll provide links to buy each and every one of these components in the video description so you can check it out yourself. Next, we have to download Kali Linux installation file for Raspberry Pi. Now let's head to our browser and then head to kali.org. Click on the download button and it should take you down here. Now you're going to see different versions of Kali Linux. We're just going to click on the one for ARM, which is what Raspberry Pi is running on. And here we go. You can see for Raspberry Pi 2, 3, 4, and 432 bits. You can also see for Raspberry Pi 5. In this case, I'm using the Raspberry Pi 3B, so I'm going to go with the first option here. But if you're using the Raspberry Pi 5, then you should go with the 64-bit version, which is right here. So I'm just going to click on the download button and it should start downloading. The file size is about 2.4 gigabytes. After downloading Kali Linux installation file for Raspberry Pi, we also have to download a software which we are going to use to create a bootable disk. So open a new tab and then search for Balena Etcher. Click on the first link that heads to etcher.balena.io. And then click on the button to download HR and it should take you down here download HR for Windows since we are running this from a Windows PC and it should start downloading now after downloading Balena HR and Kali Linux installation file we can then close our browser now let's open our download folder so here is Kali Linux installation file and this is Balena HR First, we have to install Balena HR. So let's double click on it. I agree. Now connect your micro SD card to the card reader and then connect to your PC. Now click on flash from file. Go to your download folder and then select Kali Linux Raspberry Pi ARM image. Open. Click on select targets. And your SD card should show there. Select it, select one, and then click on flash. This should take a while. You may get this prompt after flashing the OS, but just ignore and close this. Close Balena HR. Now you can eject the drive and then insert it into your Raspberry Pi to begin the installation. It should automatically turn on once the power is connected and you will see a red and green beep. The default username and password is Kali. So basically this is how to install the latest version of Kali Linux on Raspberry Pi. Bluetooth, Wi-Fi and everything else works. If this video was helpful, kindly hit the subscribe button and turn on your post notification. Thank you for watching and I will see you on the next one.